Andrei Tarkovsky, considered to be one of the leading filmmakers in cinema history, is generally recognized by his use of dramatic, spiritual, and metaphysical scenes and themes, such as the exploration of the nature of time itself. Although his views are brought forth in his various movies, underlying the narratives, the dialogues, and spatial settings, it is in his book, Sculpting in Time, that Tarkovsky clarifies his perspective on filmmaking and art. One of the main ideas is that art has a fundamental and pivotal role in man's life, since it is through art that man can understand the meaning of his own existence. Mankind, Tarkovsky clarifies, is doomed to strive endlessly for truth, a result of the expulsion from paradise and the presence of shame. Racked with longing to acquire and become one with the ideal, this unattainability creates inevitable pain, and art becomes the one tool through which this pain is expressed and can be understood. In a way, this view on aesthetics establishes connections with the classical idea of art as catharsis. Another main idea is that art is a form of acquiring knowledge of absolute truth. Artistic images of truth are a means through which an awareness of the infinite can be exposed and materialized. They are the place where the eternal is contained within the finite, he adds, the spiritual contained within matter and the limitless finally given form. But art doesn't reveal just any truth. It reveals the spiritual truth that is always hidden from our immediate awareness expressing, especially, the idea of infinity, the only means by which it can be materialized. Tchaikovsky also enhances the role of the artist itself as a link between the infinite and the audience, explaining that since art emerges from the insatiable longing for the spiritual, Art has nothing to do with the personality of the artist or his rational views, but rather it derives and acts from and on the soul. The artist, Tarkovsky explains, responds to a calling and spends his life trying to pay for the gift that has been given to him. But through this conception of images, a dynamic revelation occurs as a sudden flash of illumination, a sort of intuitive insight that connects him with the infinite. It is from this space that art is generated, communicating to the souls of man, or, as Tarkovsky so brilliantly summarizes, art acts above all on the soul, shaping its own spiritual structure.